What is going on y'all? Travis here back again with another Glee reaction. In this one today I'll be checking out Season 1, Episode 8. So, let's jump right into it, shall we? Let's go. Oh, oh god. <laughs> Damn, who's it gonna be? Dang. Dig not Finn. Terminated the queen of the chastity ball and dropped below us hockey dudes on the food chain? It's open season. Screw you, Karofsky. Welcome to the new world order. Oh, damn. A slurpee to the face. Can you imagine? No, thank you. Hey, guys. We need to talk. Okay. Emma and I are, in fact, getting married. Yes, and Ken has convinced uh. me that we need to at least be in the same room when the marriage is certified. <laughs> Uh, and you want me to come? You're gonna spend no, 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 all that no, money I to go to Hawaii, Hawaii and get married on the beach? We know. You don't even want anybody to know you're getting married, but you're spending all that money? I would like to have. I could have danced all night. Oh, from My Fair Lady. Great choice. Yeah, if you're making a mixtape for the boring parade, <laughs> I want the thong song. For your first song with your wife? <laughs> now, I want to give you these lessons as a wedding gift. I cannot believe they're getting married. Are they really getting married? They can't be. Plus, there's an important lesson to be learned with mashups. Sometimes things are so different, they don't feel like they go together. Like chocolate and bacon. Or glee club and football. Exactly. Chocolate and bacon? Together? And your homework for the week is to find an unexpected mashup to go with it. Bust a move. <laughs> That's your favorite song of all time, Shoe. I guess I'm gonna have to show these guys how it's done. <laughs> Bust it. Oh gosh. This year's a tale for all the fellas trying to do what those ladies tell us. Get shot and could care less about the five you're blowing. Peter gets dark just to start the show and then you spot a fine woman sitting. I mean, Shu can dance his ass off, though. And then you're feeling really fine because the girl is stacked. Reception's jumping, <laughs> bass is pumping. <laughs> the girls sound really good right there. I love it. They sound really good. I'm all about this. All right, Shu. I see you. I seen it. Too many friends on MySpace, or? I can't believe we're seeing MySpace. this. <laughs> oh, my God. I remember a couple years ago they tried to bring MySpace back to make it more of like a music thing. Right. Well, let's let's talk about this. Why why is it so important for you to be cool? I want to be popular. But right now we're like toxic assets. And she got into Arizona State. Sunglasses are so sexy. <laughs> Damn, you're not even listening. You're mean. I could be looking at your boobs and you'd have no idea. <laughs> Um. <laughs> um. What? Is there a reason you have it on now? I was wondering why the hell is she wearing it in the school? Actually, maybe I shouldn't wear it. No, 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 no. It's all good. It's all good. We'll, we'll, uh, we'll see how you move in it. We'll work in your song for the big finish. Okay. All right. Hey, Emma. Please. I'm really excited about this. Is she gonna sing and dance to the thong song in that dress? Just letting the old ladies know what guys talk about. Oh my god. Ooh, that dress so scandalous. And you know another guy couldn't handle it. She's shaking that thing like who's the ish. And she had dumps like a truck, truck, <laughs> truck. Thighs like what, what? I could not. Um, let me see that song. Wait, this is what Ken is supposed to be doing? Oh. Are you gonna kiss? Are you gonna kiss? Oh. Are you gonna kiss? Oh. Are you gonna kiss? Do it! Do it! It's the darn thong song. <laughs> Damn it. I don't think it's the song. <laughs> oh. Shit. Yeah, well, uh, some of the guys was talking, and we starting to question your leadership ability. Yeah, like, Damn. you sure a real man didn't sneak in there and do it for you? That's it! Wait, 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 wait. 
Well, it's funny that you say that because... Where's Puckerman? Uh, he said he had a mispractice today. He's working on something for Glee Club. What are you working on this coming out of the closet speech or something? Push me, man. When we won that one game, it wasn't because we were <laughs> dancing. It's because we were of singular purpose. I have had it up to here with Schuster and Glee. Dang. Whatever makes me happy sets you Come free. Come on, Christina. My ears are starting to hurt. Can we take a break? Okay. <laughs> You're no better than them, Noah. Why can't you date a Jewish girl? His name's Noah? Rachel was a hot Jew, and the good Lord wanted me to get into her pants. <laughs> okay. I'm sure that's what the message was. Oh, who's it gonna be this time? Is it gonna be Finn again? Oh, I picked it up for you when I was buying dip. Oh my god. Things happened pretty fast from that point. Getting her to make a couple of good-looking Jews. It's natural. I, I, I can't give myself to someone who isn't... Brave enough to sing a solo. Ooh. That's why? Are you questioning my badassness? <laughs> my badassery? I just don't see us working out. <laughs> well. Well. It's my personal tribute to a musical Jewish icon. Uh, fantastic. I can't begin to know when... He's doing his solo for all. Oh. oh, sweet Caroline. Never seen so good. Oh, now she gonna want him too? I've been inclined. Finn and Rachel and Puck and Quinn should just be swingers. They should just be. They should just go to each other. Whoever you want that day. I mean, you it's know, fine. I'm thirsty. Oh! Oh, you think that's bad? Ten just imagine what's gonna happen. Ten slurpees. Oh, hell no. People say that's She's not still how the I news. define marriage. Ah. Well, to them, I say love knows no bounds. And that's how Sue sees it. Oh, my God. <laughs> there is so much wrong with that. There is a whole lot. There is a whole lot to deconstruct there. You know, Sue, there's a lot of pressure being a local celebrity. Oh, is there? Most women find me intimidating. Maybe we could go out sometime. Have a little fondue. Ooh. Sure. What? We're gonna end up in the bottom of a lake somewhere. <laughs> I don't think I would uh, ever imagine these two. These two doing a dance number together. At first, when you suggested that I teach you How tall is steps, Jane Lynch? She's pretty hesitant. tall. I'm in love. Really? After one date, Sue Sylvester is in love. Oh, God. You sunk my battleship rod and you sunk it hard. You know, Sue, <laughs> I like to swing. <laughs> oh, my God. I think he's talking about, is he talking about being a swinger instead? I'm going to lose my mind if they are actually talking about being swingers after I just said Finn, Rachel, and all those other people should be swingers. I might be a psychic. <laughs> the Sue Sylvester who has been obsessed with sabotaging your every move is now just a distant memory. For now. For now. I mean, come on, let's be honest. What kid's gonna choose Glee Club over football? It'd be ridiculous. Rude. Sorry if me doing my job interferes with your club. Ken, we've known each other for years. Your commitment to football is about as long as your pants. It's about my fiance. You and I, the whole world knows that I'm just a consolation prize to you. How do you think that makes me feel? That's not his fault. I, I have never intentionally encouraged Emma. but I haven't discouraged her either. That's because you two love each other. We'll let the kids decide who's first choice and who's a consolation prize. Damn. Well, that's a pretty asshole move, Ken, because Will helped you win your only game and now you're being a jerk. I'm not about that. You're a great performer, Noah. I just wanna see how proud I am to have you on my arm in front of the whole high school. God 
Dang it. I can't with these Slurpees. Slushies, Slurpees, what do we call them? You know what the worst part is? It's not the burning in your eyes or the way the slushie drips all the way into your underpants. <laughs> it's the humiliation. You're choosing football over glee, which means we probably can't be together anymore. Yes. Damn. Damn, I feel like such a bad Jew. We've only got an hour for lunch, Emma. Not like trying on a pair of jeans, Will. Well, it doesn't have to be perfect. We just have to see if you can dance. <gasps> oh, she looks so pretty. Uh, so, should we see if you can dance in it? Is she actually gonna sing? I could have danced all night. I could have danced all night. Is that really her voice? Exciting. I love her. Why all at once my heart took flight. All night. Ah! You can dance in it. I love her. Uh, Ken's told all the football players in Glee that they have to choose between the club and the team. And unless all the guys choose Glee, it looks like we won't have enough members for sectionals. <sighs> Wish me luck. So, Emma, you should go tell him, Ken, to kick rocks and eat dirt. Fly a kite. <laughs> oh, are any of them going to show up? Finn, at least. I guess they're not coming. Please. I'm really sorry, guys. All of them around the corner? Yes. Just these two? <laughs> hey, I'll take two. I'll take two. Two's better. Two's better than none. Two's better than none. <gasps> wow. I was not expecting him. Choosing us over the team means you might get a slushie in your face every I day. I love that she calls him Noah. Okay, let's huddle up. Wow. Disappointed in you, Finn. You are not gonna slushy on my man, Kurt. <laughs> Why wouldn't he? He's yes, Mercedes, choice. you better tell him. Us. It's called taking one for the team. <laughs> no. Self slurpied. Someone get me to a day spa stat. <laughs> Kurt, teaching lessons. I love it. Oh my god. I cannot with her. Ooh! Ooh hey, hey, hey. That's what he meant by being a swinger! I had it made for our dance competition. Uh, but, uh, only the men wear those. Uh oh. You didn't think that we were exclusive, did you? It's the only way I do it, Rod. Heck, even my wife understood that. Oh, I mean, hey, do what you got to do. If y'all OK with it, then hey, it is what it is. So he is a swinger, but they were also going to swing dance. I hope he didn't choose how old, football because how old of is me. he? He's like, Why? he has to be because like 28. I don't think this relationship is going to work out. You won't even let me touch your boobs. <laughs> uh. He's never going to leave Quinn. Not with that baby in her belly. Yo, baby. That's yo, baby. Why don't girls like me? Because you're kind of a jerk. No offense. No offense. Get it? Ha <laughs> ha! Because his name's Noah. Ha <laughs> ha! I think I just agreed to us being together because I thought it would make Finn jealous. He probably is jealous. You just don't know it. I don't think any one decision makes your life. Unless you accidentally invent some kind of zombie virus or something. No. Uh. You're right. You're letting them decide who you're going to be. People you're not even going to know in three years. People whose names you're going to forget when you run into them in the hardware store. You don't understand the kind of pressure Max. I'm under. Go back to Glee. Hey, coach, can I talk to you about something? You got an itch down there or something? <laughs> oh, God. I see a future where it's cool to be in Glee Club. Where you can play football and, and sing and dance and no one gets down on you for it. You know about that Thursday practice? It's uh, canceled indefinitely. I got some stuff I got to do that time. Laundry, things like that. Tell Puckerman the other guys too, will you? Sure. 
Thanks, Coach. I'll need to see that set list for sectionals after all. I want it on my desk, warm from the laminator at 5 p.m. Hey, Sue. What? Didn't work out with Rod? No, it did not. You're off the Cheerios. I can't have a pregnant girl in my squad. You're a disgrace. Damn, Sue is a savage. I wanted to talk to you about your wedding mashup. He always talks so like, like a uh, soft-spoken kind of, hey. Thank you for the dance lessons. What's that mean? Are you calling off the wedding? I hope you do. I'm loaded with empty calories. Oh, you know why they call them slushies, Who don't you? Because throw? your butt looks like one if you have too many of them. Mm, brain freeze. <laughs> nah, yeah, nah, see, here's the thing. If somebody came at me with a slushy face roll, oh. we're gonna have a problem. That ain't gonna happen. You've that never is never, been that would never before, happen. Mr. Shoe? Bring it on. Give me your best shot. One, two, three. Ah! Oh. Jeez. From the top. Da <laughs> <laughs> From the top. As I was saying, though, you ever come at me with a slushy like that, I'm gonna throw something else. And it ain't gonna be a slushy. I'm gonna throw these hands. I'm just kidding. I wouldn't do that. But I just would prefer to not ever have a slushy in the face because that just. It seems painful and like a mess. And I don't really like messes. No? Not really my vibe. Anyways, that was season one, episode eight of Glee. I really dig that. That was fun. I love this show so much. I can't wait to see what happens in episode nine. This one was actually pretty light on music, though, I would say, um, compared to the other episodes that I've seen so far, uh, which is cool. I dig that. It's like a, you know, a little bit of a change of pace. Um, but yeah, I can't wait to see the next one. Make sure you subscribe, hit the notification bell. Uh, like the video and come watch it with me on Patreon if you want to see the whole thing. So I'll see you all on the next one. Bye.